Meanwhile, the federal government and the African Union is working towards providing a sustainable single-digit loan scheme for micro, small and medium enterprises to access affordable credits. Deputy Chief of Staff to the President, Ibrahim Hadija, stated these at the opening of the 2024 International Dialogue organized by the federal government and the African Union. State House correspondent Abdurrahman Jubrila tells us more. 27th of June is here again, and this is a gathering of call to action to address a continental issue using a continental solution. And I know, I'm convinced that as a continent, we can do something about this. The answer to some of these hurdles is not outside this continent, it's here. Micro, small and medium enterprises in Nigeria accounts for 96% of all businesses and has contributed to 46% of the growth domestic product. And without them, 80% of the current Nigerian workforce will be without employment. These facts provide us with the evidence that if MSMEs prosper, Nigeria prospers. And we can say the same about Africa and indeed the entire world. The African Union will sustain its global advocacy for MSMEs financing to fill the gaps with a focus on utilizing innovative digital infrastructures, including digital public infrastructure, for removing various traditional barriers in order to enhance financial inclusion. So what we have done is to assemble a group of technocrats, people that can match standards anywhere in the world to come and try or attempt to offer solutions to what these issues are. With the recent launch of the 150 billion naira intervention fund for the MSME in partnership with the Bank of Industry at a single digit loans is among other interventions of the federal government aimed at devising the appropriate continental solution for this continental problem. In Abuja, Abraham Jibrila, NTA News.